Hey, what's up? Check it out. So, uh, I got an interesting video for you today. Uh, I like to make videos about basketball things. I like to play basketball and I like to do basketball tricks. So, naturally, I have a few basketballs. Maybe you do too. So, and if not, maybe you'll just find this interesting. So, I want to mount this basketball somewhere and just shy of grabbing a roll of tape and setting it on there because that's kind of all you can do or roll it in the corner or something. I'm going to show you how I made a mount for my basketball so I could display them. So what you're going to need is a pair of pliers, you're going to need a pair of cutters, you're going to need two drill bits. Uh, you need a box cutter, you need a pen and tape measure, and a wood block. So I'm, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to take the large drill bit and I'm going to put a hole right in the middle. Oh, and you're also going to need a tennis racket too or a badminton racket. They sell these at the Dollar Tree sometimes uh, in the fall time for clearance of spring and they also sell these all the time in the spring, fall, and summer. All right, so we're gonna switch now to the smaller drill bit and put that on either side of the large hole that we made. All right, the next step, once we have those three holes drilled, is we're gonna take a box knife, and if you wanna save this string that's on here, you can, but for the most part, just go around and cut all the strings off it. All right, so now once you get all the strings cut off there, you wanna take cutters, and on badminton rackets and stuff like that, there's a spot where the shaft of it meets the neck of the hoop. I'm gonna take and cut right there. All right, then, now that you have this like this, you've got an empty hoop with this part exposed, what you're gonna do is take your center hole which my drill bit is about just a hair smaller than this. That way I can really force this thing in there and make it stay as I want it to. We're gonna push that in there and twist it around until it absolutely goes all the way in. All right, so now once we get this pushed in there and you can smack on it with something, I use the handle of it as you see to tap this in there a little bit more. You wanna have this sideways like this, that way your other two holes are here. What you want to do is go over to another area and just push down on this just lightly to start making it more rounded. And anywhere that it's not round, just kind of adjust. So now, what you can do is take and stick this on your wall, put a screw here and a screw here and the other two holes that we made to hold it in place. And then, now, you have a way of displaying your basketballs. So, the last thing to do, stay safe for watching. 